It's hard to top the view from the top our Seth Stone found in Denmark. Usually, you walk through a forest. But here there's the chance to go right up into it. And ultimately, high above its canopy of trees. This spiraling walkway, about an hour from Denmark's capital city, Copenhagen, soars 14 stories high. On a clear day from the top, visitors can see Sweden. What do you think looking up? I think it looks nice. But uh, what I'm thinking is, is actually what you are thinking, right? Because if you think it's very, very nice, then I'm glad. We want a tower. It was the brainchild of Jesper Matisen and the centerpiece of a nature park he runs called Camp Adventure. It's for everybody, right? It's for the family with the very small children. It's for the old people who don't work anymore, just want to relax a little bit, right, and have a good time. Matisen, a former Danish Navy SEAL, feels at home in the forest. And in Denmark, which lost huge swaths of forest to farming, he's hoping this might foster a connection with nature. It's a one continuous spiraling ramp. Architect Tue Foll and his team designed this unusual tower, meant to both stand out and at the same time blend in with the forest. Why did you want it to have this kind of hourglassy shape? The whole gesture is kind of uh, respecting the existing trees. So the treetops sit here and mm -hmm. the structure kind mm -hmm. of goes in exactly. and then up. Yeah, yeah. It's reminiscent of the Guggenheim in New York City, Frank Lloyd Wright's spiraling museum. Here it's not art, but the forest that's on display. The same idea is at play at New York's High Line, an elevated urban walkway where visitors get a unique perspective of the city. And at the Vessel, where architects created a soaring exterior staircase, which climbs up into the jungle of Manhattan. This seems like a very simple structure, this spiral. How complicated was it to get to this design? Well, it's complicated to make it look simple. <laughs> That's the real issue. You can't imagine how much work there is to get the simplicity perfect. A raised pathway leads visitors to the tower, so the forest itself remains untouched. We're trying to reconnect people to the forest and allowing them to do so in a manner where you don't destroy the very thing you come to see. It costs about $20 to climb this raw structure, which is built from locally sourced oak and untreated steel. If we just wanted people to access the, the view platform, we could just have installed a staircase and an elevator. But we wanted people, like everybody, to have the slow walk up through the top of the trees. It's attracted nearly 200,000 visitors since the tower opened in March. We got off the plane last night and here we are. <laughs> Lisa Algstam and her daughter Bryn came all the way from Washington State. It's just something different, something unusual, something very unique. And of course it celebrates nature. This treetop tower celebrates nature and this forest by simply allowing visitors a fresh perspective on what was always there.